Right, so this week's drug is, well, peptide, should I say, is CJ C1295, also known as DAC GRF, GRF 129, or GRF Mod 129. It's a gross hormone releasing hormone, GHRH. It's also regarded as a GRF, growth hormone releasing factor. Now it increases growth and IGF-1. Um, and a single dose has shown increases of between two and tenfold of growth and one and three of IGF-1. The half-life of this stuff is massive. Growth hormone can stay elevated for six days. IGF-1 can stay elevated for about nine days. And multiple doses have seen levels elevated for as long as 28 days. However, it doesn't flatline. It pulses. So you get GH pulses throughout the day. Now you mix this with a GHRP, as we've mentioned before, and the levels dosage-wise can be reduced as much as 50% and it will maximize output, but will not increase prolactin, which is one of the big side problems with GHRP, especially 2 and hexarin. Now, as all growth hormone pulsing agents, you know, potential problems with water retention and possible long-term use could show some insulin resistance, but nothing major. Now, what's also been found is that uh, Elevation is not linear, so a dose of 100 micrograms, if you increase that by 100%, you're only going to get a 50% yield. If you increase it by a further 100%, so we're talking 300 micrograms, you'll get a 25% increase yield. So as you increase the dose, the yield decreases in its increase, if you know what I mean. So, a bit like here in a way. As you bring the dose up, the peak actually curves the over. So there isn't really much point taking more than 100 micrograms because you're going to have to take a lot more and you're not going to get a lot more bang for your buck to maximise. Um, ideally, you'd look at taking two to three doses a day. That would be the perfect scenario. Uh, but 100 micrograms is more than enough. Any more than that, you're just going to be wasting the drug and it's pointless. Okay, so that's it for this one. A very short one, I know. Um, and I'm not sure what we're going to do next week, so I will have a look and I will get back to you on that. Take care. Speak to you soon.